seven weeks. That's it. That's how much time a Stanford professor has to find a bone marrow match to fight an aggressive form of leukemia. As ABC7 News reporter Lisa Mingalesian explains, finding a match has been especially tough. Yeah, I've been through five hospitalizations and two rounds of chemo and lots of complications. Time is ticking for Nalini Ambadi. She's accomplished a lot since she immigrated from India. She has two daughters. She's a professor of psychology at Stanford, but she has leukemia. Nalini has just seven weeks to find a bone marrow match. After that, she'll be too weak for a transplant. The cancer will be so aggressive then. Um that there's not much chance of curing it. The search for Nalini's donor started in November when her leukemia relapsed. Her students sprung into action. We're in Silicon Valley, so, so of course you're going to use technology however you can. They quickly created a Facebook page, a website, and organized donor drives all over the world. Southeast Asians are one of the smallest groups to donate bone marrow. Someone that's from an Asian descent has one in over 20,000 people finding a match. At Shirdi Sai Darbar Temple tonight, people swamped and joined the donor list. And because of the Nalini online network, for the first time, bone marrow drives like this are taking place in Kerala, India, today and tomorrow. In Sunnyvale, Lisa Amin Galesian, ABC 7 News. All right. Well, we have information on how you can register to be a bone marrow donor at abc7news.com. Just look under, see it on TV. It can make such a difference. And Save it a life. It is an easy process.